so Bayesette's disease it is a chronic relapsing autoimmune disease okay that is important relapsing okay you'll have recurrent oral aphthous ulcers genital ulcers and uveitis okay so i like to remember it with a rather uh, rude and bad mnemonic so Bayesette the person uh, okay somebody named Bayesette is blind so he's giving blowjobs so blowjobs okay oral ulcers recurrent oral aphthous ulcers and uh, uh, again genital ulcers and he's blind so uveitis okay so etiology the exact causes unknown so again you can have hla b51 association so best at b hla b association then clinical features you can have recurrent mucocutaneous ulcers so oral ulceration recurrent oral aphthous ulcers they are painful they range in size from few millimeters to two centimeters okay so they heal spontaneously recur again so in uh, genital ulcers they are similar to oral ulcers they are painful they can be seen on the scrotum and vulva skin lesions you can have acne form lesions papillar or vesicular or pustular eruptions nodular eruptions okay erythema nodosum pyoderma gangrenosum all that pathergy is an erythematous papillar response or pustular response to local skin injury so give a skin prick then one or two days later you can see uh, greater than 5 mm lesion there then ocular disease uveitis is a main feature it is bilateral episodic other features you can see retinal vasculitis vascular occlusion optic neuritis all of them may lead to blindness so vascular disease okay you, it can involve blood vessels of all sizes so other features include arthritis brain can be involved renal cardiac lung involvement epididymitis all that intestinal ulcerations also so criteria is see first you'll have recurrent oral ulcerations within one year you can see at least three episodes okay they are painful aphthous ulcers plus two of recurrent genital ulcers eye lesions so you can see anterior or posterior uveitis or retinal vasculitis skin you can see acne form lesions or papillon uh, pustular nodular lesions all of them okay and then positive pathology test then treatment again topical steroid you'll give or oral ulcers thalidomide is very effective for resistant oral and genital ulcers but it is teratogenic and neurotoxic colchicine is effective for erythema nodosum and arthralgia and systemic disease requires oral steroids with other immunosuppressive drugs